Okay, now we load the truck. The first thing we load are the two mattress boxes. If you lay them down and then stand them up in the unit, you will fill the space from the floor to the ceiling. Also, if you only have a two-wheel dolly, you should tape a pad around the metal part of the dolly so that you don't damage any furniture. Make sure it doesn't interfere with your wheels or the rolling of the dolly. The next thing we are doing is shrink wrapping a chest of drawers that we have padded. This chest has two pads and we are shrink wrapping it to protect it and keep the pads in place. This will cut down on your damages and always pad and shrink wrap the expensive furniture. Use the dolly to make the moving of this heavy dresser easier. We have made a spot on the left hand side of the pack rat unit between the mattress boxes and the wall. Don't forget the dolly. Mirror curtains should go between the wall and the padded furniture, starting on the floor. All heavy items are used as a base, and boxes are stacked on the base items to protect the box items. We can also use the wardrobe as a base item. Try to estimate the box sizes to fill your space from your base piece to the ceiling. Try to keep everything square in your pack rat unit and fill air space to prevent cargo shifting. You can also pad items when they are in the pack rat unit. Use a folding method with the folds on one side, push the item over and this will stay in place. Use two pads for a headboard to cover all exposed wood. Shrink wrapping is good for cloth cushions and couches. For extra protection, we use padding also. Do not shrink wrap leather or suede. You will get condensation between the shrink wrap and the leather, creating mold. You always want to pad wrap leather or suede. We have room for a few more small boxes. Let's go, Paul. Here is another dresser we have pad and shrink wrap. We will also use this for a base piece. Paul is pad wrapping a nightstand for protection. 
and folds the excess padding inward at each end and tapes. He uses tape instead of shrink wrap, which will hold the pad on just as well. We use the couch cushions as filler on the left side. Nightstands also make an excellent base for box stacking. We have plenty of room for boxes on the dresser base. Excluding wardrobe boxes, never stack your boxes from the floor to the ceiling. Try to stack the same size boxes when available. Heavier boxes on the bottom, lighter boxes on the top. Adjust as needed. Dish packs are heavy and usually good to put on top of a solid dresser, 